Then you go in with more cheese right on top. This welcome welcome back to my lovely viewers and subscribers thank you all so much for joining me yes so i'm back with another cooking video guys and as it is shown in the title below in this one i will be showing y'all how i prepare easy breakfast quesadillas yes i'm gonna show y'all how to make two easy breakfast quesadillas yes it's very very simple preparation is about 10 minutes and that's it very very simple guys so before i jump into it you don't know the drill go ahead subscribe to my channel if you did not now is the time to do it subscribe to my channel and hit that post notification bell so that whenever i upload new videos you will be the first to know yes you'll be notified first and like this video share with your friends and family and feel free to leave a comment below so yes i'm just gonna jump into it guys and show you how i prepare the easy breakfast quesadillas the easiest one you'll ever see stick around Okay guys, so here I have all the ingredients that I'm going to be using for my breakfast quesadillas. So over here I have um, two tortillas, here I have four room temperature eggs, here I have some cheddar cheese, here I have some red onions, some minced garlic, some bell peppers, and here I have, uh, this is actually a turkey patty uh, that I actually mince, yes, and here I have a uh, kielbasa, beef sausage, and some of my favorite garlic lovers flavor guide season so yes so these are all the ingredients that i'm going to be using so just stick around guys okay guys so in this skillet i'm going to cook up the turkey and then over here i have the kielbasa sausage boiling so i just turned the, the stove on and i put it to medium to low heat yes so the first thing i'm going to do i'm going to go in and add some of my grapeseed oil just a little like maybe a tablespoon of my grapeseed oil not a lot guys yeah just a little to cook up the beef patty and meanwhile the kielbasa is over here boiling which is almost finished anyway yes yeah, so i'm just going to let the pan heat up a little and then i'm going to add my red onions all right guys so now i'm just going to go in and add the red onions Next, I'm going to add the bell peppers. Next, I'm going to add my minced garlic. Then I'm going to go in and add So you want to cook at it until it's um, golden brown so You're just going to keep stirring it around until it's golden brown you guys. next I'm gonna add a little bit of my flavor god garlic lovers seasoning just a little just a pinch and I've decided to add some of my flavor god pink salt this is mixed with pink uh, with salt and black pepper just a pinch also and I'm going to get everything incorporated. Yes, 
yeah, so I'm just going to finish cooking this and then I'm going to remove it from the pan and set it aside. Okay, guys, so to, um, to do the egg, guys, I've decided to use a piece of my unsalted butter for the eggs, yes. So I'm going to cut piece and put in the pan. So it's up to you, guys, if you want to use the same pan that you um, cook up your turkey sausage in, your turkey patty in, rather. It's up to you if you want to use the same pan. You could rinse and use it, but I just decided to use another one. I like to do, when I'm doing eggs, I like to use the non-stick one. Yes, so I'm just going to cut a piece of the butter and add to the pan. And over here I have two room temperature eggs that I beat and I added some of my flavor god pink salt and pepper yes you can add a little milk if you want but I won't be using any milk in my egg today that's optional it's up to you if you want to do that so while the stove is on medium to low heat I'm gonna go, you know, and add my egg to the pan. Then you're gonna just let this sit and cook. Just let it cook through, guys. So stick around. Okay, guys, so as you can see, the egg is cooked through. Then I'm going to add a little of the cheese on top not a lot guys just adding some so that when i put the um the the tortillas on top it will stick yes guys so after that next i'm gonna go and add my tortilla right on top so that it will stick just use a spatula and squeeze it down and ensure that it's stick to the pan next you're gonna use the same spatula and flip the egg over yes guys so as you can see you don't want the egg to be hanging over so this is how you will do that part. All right, so the next step, I'm going to go in and add my cook up turkey patty. You're gonna put it to one side, set it to one side, guys. You don't wanna put it all over. Then you go in with more cheese right on top. Next, you're going to use the spatula and flip the tortilla like that until you can see, guys, it's golden brown right there and set it aside. Look at that, guys. Look how beautiful that is. Okay, guys. So, now it's time for the beef kielbasi quesadillas. Quesadilla, yes. So, I did the turkey patty one. So, next up is the kielbasi sausage quesadillas. Yes, guys. So... I already added my butter and I'm going to go in and the same procedure. Add your egg. This is two eggs. And you're just going to let it sit and cook through. So stick around, guys. Okay, so next I'm going to go in and add some cheese just so that the tortilla can stick to it. Yes. 
Next, I'm going to add the tortilla and I'm going to use the spatula to just squeeze it down and ensure that it is thick. It's almost time for the flip. Next, guys, just the same procedure as the first one. All right, guys, now is the time for the flip. There we go, guys. There we go. That one is perfect. Next, to one side, I'm going to add the kielbasi sausage. Next, I'm going to add some cheese. Maybe I'm going to need a little bit more cheese for this one. So I'm going to go in now with a little bit more cheese. And I'm going to flip. And there you have it guys. My easy casadillas breakfast ideas. Stick around for the taste test and camera, guys. Okay, guys. So there you have it. I went ahead off camera and I sliced them. I decided to just let them stay on my cutting board. And we're going to serve it with a glass of cold orange juice. Yes, guys. So this is my easy breakfast quesadillas idea. It's very easy, guys. Just a few ingredients. Eggs, the tortillas, um... You can use whatever filling you want. You can use whatever sausage, whatever beef patty, whatever you want to use, you can use it inside. You can add some tomatoes and stuff to just, you know, spice it up a little. So there you have it, guys. And of course, your girl is going to do the taste test and camera. So stick around. All right, people. All right, people. I'm ready for the taste test. People may have a whole pizza here. A whole pizza. I'm not lie. This is like a pizza. Mm-hmm. Nice. Yeah, people. So I don't even know which one to taste, but I think I'm gonna go in with the kielbasi sausage one. Right? Who agree? Right? There we go. There we have it. Mm -mm -mm. Up up close and personal. Mm. Mmm. 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 -hmm. People, I love orange juice. I drink orange juice by the. Go ahead and try it, guys. Just a minute. And the most important thing, you can just put these in a container and pop it in your fridge. Simple. And just reheat it in your microwave for like 40 seconds or 50 seconds to a minute in the morning and you're good. People who have kids, you can make it overnight. Get up in the morning, just reheat it. Your kids will love this. I'm telling you, this was a bomb and this is a must try. Go ahead guys and try it and leave a comment below and tell your home girl how it turned out for you. So there you have it for today. This is my easy, um quesadillas idea breakfast idea go ahead and give it a try like i said so this is the end of this video i know y'all gonna miss me but just stick around and i will see you guys in my next video yes so please remember to like this video share with your friends and family subscribe and hit that post notification bell so that whenever i upload new videos you will be the first to know yes guys so that is it for today and i'm out for now but there is another part I'm leaving out. Please remember to put God first, second, third, and your blessings will flow forth. I guarantee you that. Thank you so much for watching this video. I love you all and thank you for the continuous love and support. Stick around with your girl and I will see you, you, and you in my next video. That's it for now. I'm out.